Good morning guys So magluluto po tayo ng Salisbury steak Okay, for our main ingredients Kailangan po natin ng beef Cut of your choice Garlic or bawang Mga lima o anin Sweet corn Black pepper and salt bell peppers, red and green carrots sa gravy naman po we need flour nor cubes, beef flavor butter so first step po is to sharpen your knife kailangan natin ng matalim na kuchilyo bakit? Kasi, kailangan natin hiwain ang beef na maliliit at maninipis Parang pang beef steak or pang beef, or, uh, beef with broccoli Mga ganyan, maliliit lang Careful sa mga um, naghihiwa Be careful po, magpatulong sa mga nakakatanda Kasi if you have a uh, um, sharp knife, delikado po yan makahiwa ng kamay. Second is we need to marinate our beef. We need some salt and pepper. Mga 1 teaspoon lang each. Then, sunod is oyster sauce. Yeah, mga 5 teaspoon. Ngayon, mix well. Ihaluin po ng mabuti. And then, pakatapos, is it? set aside for mga 15 to 20 minutes or even 30 minutes must better Side aside. So no carrots. Slice your carrots thinly and um, slice it in strips. Manipis at pahaba po ang slice. Sumunod ay ang bawang Kailangan natin ng Not so means na bawang So Crush your bawang Balatan and then chop it into small pieces After you chop your 
garlic. There you go. Is your bell pepper. So same lang po na hiwa sa carrots. Huwag nyo lang isali yung mga um, seeds ng bell pepper. So linisan. And then now makalinis. Yan, alisin yung seeds. Now slice it into strips also just like the carrots so that it will be uniform. So yan po, carrots, bell peppers, red and green, and your garlic. Now on your frying pan, heat your um, pan. Tapos, lagyan ng mantika. Kaunti lang. And then, lagyan ng butter. Yan. Butter can add flavor and color just the saltiness alright so saute your garlic yeah, hanggang mag golden brown or even just a slight brown next is your Carrots. Pagka uh, brown na yung garlic, isusunod po natin ay yung carrots. Ayan, pag brown na yung garlic, sunod na yung carrots. Gisa-gisa lang. Stay for about 3 to 5 minutes. So now this is your sweet corn. Drain your sweet corn. Pag nasa lata, drain po. Hindi isali yung tubig. Drain it first and then saute your corn. Saute it again for about 3 to 10, ah, uh, 3 to 5 minutes, sorry. 3 to 5 minutes only. is your bell peppers yan so they yet and you can season it with salt and pepper masyadong i-overcook ang bell pepper yung tipong crunchy lang Once you're finished, set it aside. And on 
the on the same um yeah set aside and on the same um pan put a bit of oil and then start frying your beef Spread it evenly onto your pan. And turn it after 2 minutes. Turn to the other side after 2 minutes. Alright, so the other side naman, I try natin. Fry fry lang hanggang sa maluto yung beef. Stir stir every after two minutes on both sides. All right now para mabilis maluto at lumambot, simmer it. Yon, that's what we want to make our beef brown. Your beef if it's um, soft. From Lipa, stay. From Lipa, not long, but the Korean parang mga beef. So taste it and then if kulang pa ng salty, um, you can add salt or pepper. Preferred depending on your um, preferred taste. Then simmer. So after that, we're gonna make the gravy. So on your saucepan, put a bit of oil. And then put also the butter. Two teaspoon of butter. And then melt it. The next is put on your flour. Yeah, so that's what you uh, do. Make a roux on it. And then once it's you start pouring some water and then stir it slowly but uh, consistently
so that's um, the consi consistency that we want on our gravy so you can um, enhance the taste by adding the broth cubes or the beef cubes and then salt and pepper and then put the one in your gravy pot that's So next one is start heating your sizzling plate and put the butter while it's not too hot yet para di tumalsik yung lang uh, yung mantika yung butter yeah so if you feel that it's hot already start um, putting now your beef your Salisbury steak Spread it all over the system plate and then you can now put the gravy on top of it. Pasisan lang natin ng kaunti and then we can put the gravy when it says sizzle that is thing that's the gravy so you can mix it while um there on the sizzling plate or serve it with the gravy on top and then that's it your Salisbury steak so enjoy your meal hopefully 